Hey guys, today we are in Lancaster, or Lancaster, however you guys want to say it, at the Amish Farm and House. Now we're not here to tour this, we're here to go to the barbecue barn, because we've heard a lot about this place, haven't we, Bobby? Yeah. We're going to go back there and check it out, and you guys are coming with us. So are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. All right, guys, going to show you how to get to this place. It's real simple. You just got to look for Target right off the Lincoln Highway. And if you look over here, you will see the Amish farm and house, and you're just going to go back in behind it, right back here. Take a little stroll. And they got uh, picnic tables to eat at back here. We're going to try to get that one. Nobody sits there. So, come through here. And we need to try a pretzel today, too, Bobby. Okay. I heard their pretzels are good. So, you're kind of on the right side of it. Target. There it is, the barbecue barn, right there. This is Amish Run. So it ought to be pretty good. The barbecue barn, barbecue chicken, baby back ribs, sandwiches, pulled pork, ice cream, milkshakes, and soft pretzels. Let's go check out the menu here. That's our soft pretzels, $2 each, three for five. Homemade root beer, pulled chicken dinner, $8.75. Rib dinner, $16.50. Half chicken, $10.95. Chicken leg dinner, $8.50. Pulled pork barbecue dinner, $9.50. And all the dinners include three barbecue potatoes, cold slaw, dinner roll, a whoopie pie, and a drink. It's a good deal. If you want to go a la carte, get your full rack of ribs for $23. Half rack, $11.75. Half chicken, $6. Chicken leg and thigh, $3.25. Sandwich, full pork, $4.95. And full chicken sandwich. And homemade root beer, grilled hot dog, cheeseburger, and iced caramel latte. We're going to try this today. Fall is my favorite. So we're going to try the apple cider milkshake. And it's $4.25. And it says sweet apple cider, a dash of cinnamon, creamy vanilla ice cream, and a hint of fall. Wow, that, that sounds good. So, you can see guys, this is just a little tiny shop back here right next to this attraction that you guys can tour. Right here. There's the whole, that's the whole building. Go back into there. Okay, let's go order. Okay guys, just got our picnic table that we wanted. Let's open up the meal. It's like in a different stuff. You got a little enjoy your meal. We'll do that. Trip advisor if we enjoy it. Got some coleslaw, a roll, and one of my favorite things, a whoopie pie. Let's see the chicken. chicken. That smells excellent. <laughs> they came in a little bag like this. That looks excellent. Yeah, it not good. only smells, and there's the potatoes. It's really windy out here. It is. I hope my stuff don't blow. And I might have some shadows out here. That's what I'm trying to. But, wow. Look at the bags the, don't blow. There we have our milkshake. Milkshake and then sandwich. And a leaf just blew in. A lot of pork. Well, that is a lot. And we also, over here, so that, had to get a pretzel. We ask them, they make those. So we got a lot of stuff here to try. And it was what, 23? $23 for everything. And Bobby's Coke came with that. Let's just look at that chicken again. And those potatoes. Bobby, try the milkshake first before it melts. Okay. Apple cider milkshake. Supposed to be a little hint of fall. Yep. What it tastes like? It tastes like an apple pie, with, but sweeter. Well, it has it cinnamon in like? it, didn't it? Well, no, it's the apple cider that makes it okay. sweet. And it said it had a hint of cinnamon in it. I like that. I would let's see it again. Let's, after you take a drink. We'll let's, one more drink before I show you, John. Okay. Let everybody see it out there. Look at that. It's different. I, it is, it's you do like flavor. it? Yeah. I have to try it. 
ago. That is a strong tasting milkshake. And that is You think it's strong pie. tasting? Mm -hmm. I mean, oh. the way taste the apple. Oh yeah, you I can. Mean, the apple cider, you taste, can. Really taste that. I mean, sometimes you get chocolate milkshake, it just but this is really that's good. Tastes like fall. It does. I mean it tastes like you can really taste the apple cider. Taste a little bit of the cinnamon in there. But it's like frozen apples. Mm, yeah. It's excellent. This is a good this is a good choice. 425. Bobby's going to try the coleslaw. They said it's all Amish made. I like that. It's chopped real fine. I like mine cut like that. Yeah, it is chopped real fine. Mm -hmm. Here it's some stuff. And then you got your potato. Let's take a well, look at this. I don't have a knife to cut it with, but I'm just going to have to eat it like this, I guess. I'll just show you. Barbecued potato. Them. You just bite it. Oh, I can taste the barbecue. Yeah, I got a little bit of. I can see it on the top. Mm-hmm. You're going to put. Some, I'm okay. I can see like a little bit. It looks like a. Looks like a dry rub, maybe. That's what I think it is. Yeah. But that chicken looks amazing. Yeah, look at that. There's your leg. Yeah, just tear into that breast meat. Wow, it just comes apart. We don't need any barbecue sauce no. with this. That smells really good. Ooh, that's hot. Smell the smoke. Yeah, smoke flavor. That's nice and tender. And like all this flavor is inside of that. That's probably one of the best smoked chickens I've ever had. I mean, you can smell it. I can smell it clear over here. Now oh, this yeah. was only, what, ten ninety five for all this. So yeah, if you, you go to the bigger that. restaurants, it'd be $16 for chicken dinner. Yeah. And it included a drink. And yeah. you're sitting outside. And you're sitting outside. And you can shop if you want to. Have yeah. yeah, go into Target and shop. All right, guys, I'm going to try the pork barbecue sandwich. Okay, guys, now we decided just to get the uh, pork. So we figured we'd share the rest of it because we're going to try to eat something else again today. Is that not loaded? That is loaded. Let's just try this. Look at all that. Mm. Wow. Man, that is so tender. You can taste the smoke in that. The seasonings they used in it. That is good because we know barbecue because we go to Memphis and eat all that. It's really windy, so we're trying not yeah. to lose our napkins yeah. and stuff going blowing everywhere. We don't want to leave a mess. I'll tell you what, that's one of that's one of the best ones I've ever had. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like that. It's got a little sweet taste to it. I don't know if it's a barbecue sauce that they're using there. Uh -huh. so that is a that is a lot. That is. Was, and if you got that separate, it was like three. It was four. four oh, something. it was four I think, something. I think it was four. You can that's check on the bad. beginning what we wrote, what we said. When we went. I think it was four something, but four ninety five. But that's definitely that's definitely worth it. Yes, I mean, that, that is. is. That is so much falling off. Yeah. So we're gonna get. We're we'll gonna get it get eating, eating and we'll come back milk. here in a little bit and we will tear into that whoopie pie. I just wanted to correct myself. I didn't think I had a knife, but underneath everything, look. They you did. did. They gave you everything. Knife, fork, and spoon. Don't normally see all three no. of them in one. So it was under here. But yeah, I just pulled it apart. But now I have my knife. We just wanted to make sure so we didn't lie to you. <laughs> Alright, now we're gonna commence the eating. Bobby said I would like this potato. So I'm gonna try it. Until it's done right. Well, that is good. You can taste the hint of the barbecue they put on top, the dry rub. Yeah. It's cooked. I like it like that. Yeah, it's cooked definitely all the way through. Mm hmm. It's got a little crispiness when you first chomp into it. I like that. That is. That's good. I've never seen it. I've never seen it done like that in a meal anywhere. Well, I'm going to try this piece of the chicken. Look at that. I'm going to try There's this. a lot of meat there. Man. And there's a beef lying around. I He's trying him. to get some. Mm-hmm. You can smell it. He knows it's good. Mm-hmm. 
Well, you can taste that smoke flavor all the way through. Yeah. And I like the skin. But look at that, guys. That's nice and tender, oh, isn't it? It is. Wow. Great job, Barbecue Barn. Dessert time. One of John's favorite right. desserts. Yeah, this is, I love it. I actually bought a pan to make these whoopie pies and um, got a recipe. I've done them a couple times. You bought the pan up here. I did. Cake's fresh. I like the cream. It's just cream by itself. Oh, there you go. There you go. Ah, it's messy. It is messy. Well, it's a little warm out here, so it's kind of it's my fingers. Yeah, and we already ate the, sun's the milk, so there. it's melting. But uh, I like it. The cream's not overly rich. Mm -hmm. I like the cake. It's, it's decent. It's not the best whoopie pie I've had here because Percy Farms has a great whoopie pie. Yeah, and they make them in different flavors yeah. too there. I, but, here I think they just had chocolate, but yeah, they make this, them pumpkin or peanut yeah, butter. It's definitely good. I mean, you can't beat it. It comes with a meal. Yeah, you can't included. beat that. Okay, so here's the pretzel. And then, like John said, they make them here. Yeah, we ask them. Nothing better than an Amish pretzel. Yeah, they got a little bit of salt. Buttery flavor. That's the thing about the Amish pretzels, they're always yeah. buttery. Yeah, we've watched them make them how they yeah. dip the butter. It's a good pretzel. A butter gives it really good flavor. Do you need dip with that or just eat it like that? No, I can eat them just plain. I like the taste of pretzel itself. That was uh, $2. You could get three of them for five. So. Yeah. Better than uh, Annie Ann's, I bet you. What do you think? Yeah, I like it because it's a little bit thinner too. And I feel like a thicker pretzel, but there's a lot there. Okay, so everything here is everything here is pretty good. Well, guys, I had to try it. I want to say you can really taste the butter, like Bobby said. It's, it's excellent. We went to that country uh, road stand one too that one time up here, and it was a great pretzel. So they're about equivalent. They're about the same. I mean, it's, yeah. We thought that one was great. I can't tell which one I like better, but there's one more. There you go. It's hard to choose. It is. Which is better. But, but this is it's really a good choice. It's um uh, butter, when you just bite into it, you can really taste the butter. You don't need dip with that. No. I mean you could put some cheese on it, but I guess it's good. No, like you want to taste the pretzel, not the yeah, cheese. Tastes, so good. I mean nothing else I can say about the place is good. Well guys, we just left the barbecue <laughs> barn and right there. Thumbs up. Perfect. What'd you think about it, Bobby? Yeah, it was it was excellent. I'm so glad we came here. We were able to sit outside. It was so pretty today, right, John? Oh, Instead beautiful. of sitting inside. It's a little windy, but it's still yeah. beautiful. Instead of sitting inside in a restaurant, we got to enjoy the sunshine. Uh, that chicken <laughs> was the best chicken, really. The flavors that were smoked in there and that just pulled apart. It was. You didn't need barbecue you sauce. Didn't. We didn't even get any. We got no barbecue sauce. We didn't need it. I like the potatoes it. and uh, the coleslaw. Now the roll was good, but it was just a basic yeah, store-bought roll. Yeah. But they can't make, you know, everything. No, so. no but the uh, coleslaw was homemade, the whoopie mm -hmm. pie is homemade, the pretzel. How about the pretzel? Oh, I like the pretzel too, yeah. It was uh, real buttery, a little bit of salt, not, not a lot, mm -hmm. but it had a good flavor. And this place has been here four years. Yeah, we well, talked to them, we asked them. And the pulled pork sandwich, unreal. A guy walked by me, <laughs> said, Man, this thing is huge. I mean, it was. I had a hard time eating the whole thing, but you definitely want to eat the whole thing because it is that good. And uh, the whoopie pie, whoopie pie is great. Now, Hershey Farms, like I said, probably has the best whoopie pie here, but this one's pretty close. And the thing about it, it comes with your meal. Was it $10.95 and you get a drink? Now, a buffet, what, $25, $26 yeah. around town a person? You can come here and we spent 23 bucks and we can't eat any more. And the milkshake. Bobby, you like the milkshake. I did. It reminded me of fall. <laughs> we asked them. It's uh, apple cider and vanilla ice cream and cinnamon. And, uh, man, you could really taste the apple cider. We might it. have to try to make that. We might try it. He kind of told us how to make it, so we might try it. We got a secret. We got, we got <laughs> the secret. So we are highly recommending this place. Maybe come here next to Target, tour the house. 
I don't know if the house is affiliated with these guys at all, but tour the home, then come over here and get something to eat. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J&B have, have left, left the building. building. Hey guys, this is why we are here in Lancaster, right behind us. Johnny Mathis, 65 years. What do you think of that, Bobby, 65 years? I love years. Johnny. He sounds so amazing. Oh, he? sounds the same I mean, as he did he in does. the 50s. So we're, he looks great. Too. Yeah, he does. And we've met him a couple times. I don't know if we'll get to meet him tonight because of the COVID, but it doesn't matter. We're still here to hear this man sing, and I am excited about seeing him. So are you ready to go check him out, I'm Bobby? Ready. Let's go.